So the next example is BF3 and TH3. This one is a little different than the others because um, these are Lewis acids, not um, not Brownstead lottery. So the way we're going to do this is decide what atom is actually um, acting as an acid. So boron is what makes an attack to grab um, another lone pair. So it accepts another lone pair, the boron. Now let's look at what's surrounded by boron. For the first one, you have the fluorines, which are highly electron um, electronegative. So you're going to have these relations here, whereas hydrogen don't do anything. So fluorine is making it deficient, more deficient. Fluorine's making the boron more deficient to grab another lone pair and become stable. So that means it is um, making, that means it, the boron, this acid, would want to grab the lone pair um, more likely than BH3. So in this case, BF3 is going to be more acidic. So this is a little different than the other examples that we did because these are Lewis acids, um, not Bronsted lottery. The Teaching Center, UF's Learning Resource Center.